Ben Franklin's Head, 1728, by M. A. De Wolf Howie. To Cotton Mather once there came a Boston boy on wisdom bent. If all the world knew not his name, Ben Franklin yet could wait content. They talked. And when the talk was done, in Mather's study talk was brief, young Ben arose to go as one who felt, as who would not, relief. To quit the theologian's lair, the priestly Puritan's retreat, through a dark passage he must fare with halting, unfamiliar feet. Behind him, Mather, careful host, his groping exit sought to guide, and where a danger threatened most, stoop, stoop, in friendly warning cried. Poor Ben, he heard, or he did not, a plague upon a beam low spread, so sharp, a whack his forehead got, the wisdom joggled in his head. But Mather, ever prone to preach, drew straight an ethic parallel. Let this, my friend, its lesson teach. Twill serve you in remembrance well. The world still lies before you, Ben. Stoop as you tweed its devious ways and many thumps from many men you'll miss through all the coming days. Ben Franklin, through his length of years, held that chance counsel still supreme, and stooping oft among his peers, triumphant passed neath many a beam. So blending practice and belief, the sage still watched the world rolled by and marked how many came to grief because they held their heads too high.